I think what made Swifty stand out was firstly the accuracy. We could predict what you're about to say. We did much better error correction than the competitors. But equally, at the same time, we're always learning, we're always adapting to your personal language style. So I, th I think for, for SwiftKey, it all started with an idea, which was we got to be able to improve typing on, on smartphones. Most of the time, we were working kind of evenings and weekends. It wasn't our full-time commitment at the beginning. And it was actually Innovate UK grant, which enabled us to then transition from part-time to full-time. I remember walking through Waterloo Station, and I got a phone call from Ben saying that we'd been awarded the grant. And I remember just stopping and laughing. We couldn't believe anyone was stupid enough to give us £20,000. From kind of an idea to being almost at the top of the app store it took us about two years. And at that stage, no, no, no real marketing. It was really word of mouth, and people love the product, told their friends about it. You can't go from nothing to doing a deal with Samsung on day one, but I think over several years of hard work, we built our credibility up, we expanded and improved our product. We went from, I don't know, one or two languages covered to suddenly having 80 languages or 100 languages. I mean, a keyboard's not useful unless everyone in the world can use it. We spent a lot of time, I guess, building the team up so we had the capabilities to be able to operate at that kind of scale. 2008 and 9 it was essentially just me and Ben. Then in 2010, we started hiring. And I think pretty much every year we then doubled in size. We ended up about 140 to 150 when we got acquired. I think for us, we weren't ever really focused on acquisition, but we started working with a number of the leading partners. And so I think at a certain point, I think the business then attracts more interest from potential partners. And eventually in 2016, Microsoft came in and, and offered to buy the company. I think the reason that the acquisition's been, I think, a great success has been that actually they wanted to take what we were already doing and just help us accelerate that faster, make the keyboard better, get more people using Swifty. We now have greater resources uh, and greater assets across wider parts of Microsoft to be able to achieve that vision faster.